Hi guys, it's Mystical Gamer signing in to say we are heading to Markovdon System in the Artemis Tower Cluster. One, well, the second we get all the way out of here, so the Markovdon System. Oh wait. All right, and now we're going to be doing some Asomi Asari diplomacy. Ugh, this is going to be the second to last episode in my bundle. Oh uh, well, actually, not really. If I believe right, it's on a pirate ship. So, survey. So writing's discovered. Unknown. There we go. Okay, come on. We need to find something. If I believe right, it was on a planet. Not a planet, a spaceship. And did I get it right, or...? Well, apart from a shy ton of money. Uh So it could be that planet. Uh. Oh well, this may or may not be the correct planet, but Alas, Poyoric, we will not know, and I believe Alas, Poyoric is going to be my catchphrase from now on, isn't it? God damn it, I did not want that to be my catchphrase these this week of episodes, but god damn. And again, more Mako. I swear, this game is, we've been spending most of this game in the Mako, and you guys are going to hate me when we get back into the main story missions, because again... I have to complain about the Mako. You spend like more than half this game in the Mako. Stronghold. Oh, there we go. And an anomaly. Let's head to the stronghold because I really don't want to spend any more time in the Mako than we already have. And a level 1 hazard. So, let's see. What is level 1 hazard what I think? Yeah, the level 1 hazard's very low. I it will just blast you to pieces if you spend too long out there. But it's not as bad as the other hazards in which you can literally spend like four seconds out there. This one you can spend maybe I think maybe thirty seconds out there and then you can just then you're screwed. Also, all damage to the Mako has been fixed, so yays. And actually something I noticed from the last few episodes, going back over it in my head, is that well, how the hell do you land this thing on a asteroid? Like, I know we are beginning to do science and where if we ever have big asteroid anomalies, we can actually, like, fire rockets up in space and slow them down so we, uh, like, they don't crash and cause the end of the catastrophe on Earth. But you have, I'm actually questioning, how, is it based on the same idea, you just fire it in or, but, like, isn't the ship, the asteroid, moving at millions upon millions of miles per hour? So, if an asteroid is moving like a thousands upon thousands upon thousands of miles an hour, how the hell do you move yourself fast enough to, uh, you know, or slow enough to be able to descend and land on one correctly without blasting yourself into a million freaking pieces? Sorry, that's just food for thought. Like, if anyone in my comments, like, in my... Because I know I've got two people who probably just watched my episodes just to troll them. Like, if you want to, please do answer me this question. Like, why... How does that work? Like, I, I'm too lazy to research and I'm too busy as well with all my co college work. But if you could answer me that, I would actually be very, very... Like, very, very happy if you answered that for me. I, I might just give you a... YouTube name a shout out and then you could troll people even further if you wish to. So, you know, we're kinda of working both ways, you know. Alright, so let's go and invade. Ah, pirates, 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 pirates. 
Bitch, you don't have anywhere near enough power. Oh, Krogan, 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 Krogan. I thought that they had something, but... I thought that was that dead Krogan actually had health, and I was like, how the... That would be one hell of a glitch. I'm not even sure what half those little things are. Like, their body type is not used. Why is a medical station locked up tight in the nun's ass? I have no idea. Oh well. <laughs> and Stephen wants me to play Star Wars. Dude, I don't have the game. I don't play Star Wars. Alright, so now we found out that uh, the Asari ambassador was actually lying to us and that her sister was the leader of the pirates, also known as the thing I shot in the face a few seconds ago. Well, women are not... well, are alien women a thing? I, I actually really don't know. Should, uh, should I consider myself sex? You know what, I really don't know. I'm not going to consider that because, like, Asari are unigendered, so they're both male and female, so... I kind of can't call myself sexist on that part. They look female, but then again, you male and female, like a man, isn't. Actually, this is just the educate, like science educational episode. But yes, well, that was bugged. Um, but yeah, okay. If you if you guys really don't know, then uh, I should explain this. There is no, like, pure gender. Like males and females were all of it. Like. All males were actually originally females in the womb. Yeah. Surprise, surprise, dickheads. Like, all you sexist assholes out there. You were once a chick. Haha, <laughs> imagine that. That's actually something you can bring up in a conversation or creep out half the guests, but... Like, you could just go... A little child going, I was once a... I was once a... Girl, mommy. Yes, you were, child. Now put, now put your clothes on. Like, that... I, I just sound like Morgan Freeman then as well. Jesus Christ, my vocal cords need to be checked <sighs> my brain as well because considering if I can think of half that stuff up but return to Normandy and that was that mission done so I literally think we only have one more micro mission to go before we're done but that's gonna be a two-parter because ay 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 yeah that one is definitely gonna be a two-parter so let's head back to I'm going to be doing another time skip, so I'll meet you guys back at the Citadel. See you guys in just a sec. Hi guys, welcome back. Alright, now that we are, uh, well, now that you survived the time skip, oh god, I hate, the, I hate the elevators, I honestly hate them, but let us carry on and, well, do some stuff. All right, actually, there's an X down there. We'll check that out on the way back. But first, diplomat. This place seems strange. All right. Yes, Shepard. Did you find my sister? You lied to me, bitch. Dahlia's dead. I killed her myself. If you don't want to end up like her, start talking. No need to raise your voice, Commander. Surely you can understand why I lied to you. If people found out my sister was a criminal, I'd be considered a security risk. <laughs> They'd revoke my clearance, or place me on administrative leave until she was apprehended. That is why I misled you. I could not risk you exposing me. But now that Dahlia is out of the picture, it 
that's no longer a problem. I don't like being used, bitch. Do your own dirty work next time. I am sorry I wasn't honest with you. We have trust issues in my family. Obviously. <laughs> Good one, Ashley. I should transfer a little something into your account as a token of my appreciation. I'm sure you'll find the amount satisfactory. Credits won't cut it. I'm a specter, not some merc for hire. I can find credits anywhere. True, but I'm the only one who can authorize you to purchase prototype Asari mods. I will get you added to our manufacturer's preferred client list. I think you'd be very interested in what they have available. Goodbye, Shepard. It has been a pleasure doing business with you. And this is where I wish I could kill you. I gave you what you wanted, Shepard. We have nothing more to discuss. Ugh, bitch, I wish to kill you. So badly. But alas, I cannot. Because, well... I just can't. God damn, such a lot of rules. I would have killed that bitch in an instant. It would also save me a lot of trouble in Mass Effect 2. Ha <laughs> ha And, oh, so the Exus. Uh, considering the fact that I never used her. Alright, before we leave, there is two things... Well, yeah, there is two things I need to do. First of all... We need to head to the markets. And I need to head to the markets for very, two very, 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 very specific reasons. Both of which involve... Well, one of which can involve money, and one of which can involve some slight comedy. Let's see which one we get. Well, we want both, but let's see where I pop out. Oh, so good. As you guys might have remembered... Welcome back, Prince Clan. Will you be needing supplies for your return? Show me what you got. I want the Medi to upgrade. Bitch, I just need that. Don't need anything else from you. Fact, I would like you to buy okay, maybe I do need something from you. Yeah, I just need your pistol. So you guys are seeing me doing business transactions, but yeah, I basically don't need half the scrap. All right, now for the hey, comedy. Commander, there are rumors on the extranet that you've been made the first human specter. That's incredible. Get lost. I don't have time for this crap. Go back to whatever hole you crawled out of. So that's how it is? The rest of us should just let you reap the fame and glory? Well, you're not the only one who can stand up for humanity. I'll show you. And again, we can just basically kick the lid the lidded? The living shite out of it. But hit it? Jesus Christ. Conrad is a failure and half, but... Hello there! Welcome to Moreland's famous shop. You want... Oh, you will be pleased, I think. Very good things New standard items. Please say you've got... Yeah, you've got a grenade upgrade. Pulse rifle. That thing will rip. Enemies in half for me, which I kind of need. So, let's go to the equipment. And, okay, I'll have to upgrade everything off-screen, but, yep, hang on, actually, upgrade it on-screen.
Alright, well, now that that's done, next time on Mass Effect, I will basically be doing some of the other small missions, because, actually, that thing looks geth to me. Is it me, or does that thing look like a geth weapon? I think I just bought geth technology. Oh well. Alright guys, well, this is Mr. Ball Gamer, letting you know to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time, where we will be doing, I think, two more missions where we're, we're going to be taking on the Criminal Syndicate, as well as, I think there is one other mission we might need to do, and then we'll be heading off to uh, Novaria. But apart from that, see you guys then.